Hey guys, um, <clears throat> I'm gonna do another video, so I'm just gonna upload it tomorrow because it's getting late. Um, this is a review on my um my bass guitar. This is my GNL. I have a I have another bass guitar. It's an OLP, but I don't have it with me. It's at my other home. But it's at my other home right now. So um, this is it. This is the best one I have. This is the GNL Tribute. Um, it's I think it was made in the I think it was made in 2007. I used to have the um bark I mean the coat on it and everything. I think it was seven. Um, it's a solid P. This is a this is not the standard. This is the premium. The the difference is um the um the standard had a basswood body, but this is a swamp ash body. See all the natural marks in it. Beautiful piece of wood. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I put some strap lock systems on it. My strap um. I forgot my strap at my other house, and I don't have it with me right now. Um, these are the controls. This is for volume. This is for bit. Uh, I'm sorry, tone. And this is for um, bass. And these three-way switches. This is a two-way. This is there's these two are three ways. This one's two-way. This one, if you do it all the way towards you, it's gonna only operate this pickup, so it's gonna be the neck pickup. Put it on two, it's gonna be both of them, so like the. You're gonna do both pickups. You do it towards the. Do it towards the bottom, it's only gonna do this pickup. Give you more of a stingray. Any ball stingray sound. This gives you more of an oldie sound, this gives you a full sound. This is, um. So that's the pickup selector. This is series parallel. Towards you, series. Towards the back, parallel. It's a different sort of sound. And right here is the, um. Preamp. It's um all the way towards you. It's on active. Ah, I'm sorry, passive. In the middle, it's active. All the way to you, it's the um active with treble boost. Now, so um, oh yeah, that's the saddle lock bridge. Um, yeah, oh yeah, really quick. It says the G and L in there. It's like it's like stomped in there. This is a um um. Uh, maple neck. Um, it's um. Uh, oh yeah. By the way, I use um Roto Sound Swing 66 bass strings. Um, it says G and L L2000. Really small there. It says um tribute series. These are um G and L open back um um. Traditional style open back tuners. Um, GNL always has that that point right there. George um, GNL stands for George and Leo Fender. It was actually George um, um, George Fullerton and Leo Fender. And what Leo Fender once said was, "These the GNLs are the real Fenders." The back that's the um and everything in here. Oh, I'm gonna go on this side. This is um. You can probably see like the next turning to change colors. I think that's a bit of dry sweat right there, and it's just changing colors from holding. It's um a six bolt neck. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. And that's the play to get inside. And right here is Victor Wooten's autographs. When I saw him, it was very good. So he signed the back of this. I took that, and I built a protector to go over that. And um, he was really good. I, I, I love Victor Wooten. And um, I... And really quick, the one that I've been using for the videos tonight was this custom KBA-16. Here. It's the red LED. I have an Ampeg B100R Rocket Series. What amp, that's my best one. This is my box cord that I use all the time. It says... I'm getting the light here. 
So this box right there, it's a right angle cord. I think it's like a nine and a half, uh, like probably like a twenty foot cord. This is my gig bag for my GNL. It says GNL right there. It can hang on a door. It's very padded inside. It has the straps so you can carry it around your bag like a book bag. But um yeah, this if you're looking for a nice base, these are these are the ones. These were rated higher than the American made ones. They're made. They're made. The, the 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 counterparts were made in um Indonesia, but this is the pickups were made in the USA. But I suggest you getting one of these if you need if you want a nice bass guitar. I think they're going for about seven hundred right now. But back then I bought mine for about five hundred and fifty bucks. So five hundred five hundred fifty bucks somewhere around there. So um yeah, I worked my ass off for that money. All right then. And that's about it. Any questions? Ask me. Oh yeah, take the nine volt battery for the for the active pickups. Um, so please rate, comment, and subscribe. And that's about it. Thank you. Bye.